Hi Sagittarius, it's Elle here to do your mid-June reading. Um, okay, so we've got past, present, future, and love, career and finance, additional cards of support. We've got our cards at the bottom of the deck. Alright, so let's start off with love. Thank you to those who like, share, comment, subscribe to the channel. I'll save the announcements to the end. Five of Pentacles in love. Alright. Some of you aren't feeling as confident, as sure of yourself. Some of you, now this could be action taken against your action that you took mm -hmm. in regards to mm -hmm. someone else. You could be dealing with a Capricorn Virgo Taurus. Someone's feeling shut out here. Let's see. In the past, we have the Lord, Aries, Taurus, the husband type figure. And then we have the moon and the three of wands. Definitely reads not just a solo, rela uh, a two party relationship reads as maybe for my Sagittarius men you you might have had more than one party here could be a Cancer Pisces or Scorpio you were hiding it I think you're choosing to leave behind this third party stuff I think it might have even came out that you were doing this you might in the past, you might have met with this person at night. It's always a, a night thing. Hmm. Presently, we have the Two of Cups and then the Fair Lit. Um, this is the Temperance card. This is Sagittarius. You're in love with someone, and it's like a soulmate type of connection. You had to cut something or leave someone out. The Three of Wands and the Five of Pentacles. You could be with a Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, or someone with water in their chart presently or trying to get to them or there's something in regards to that person. They bring you balance. You feel like the relationship is balanced. The masculine and the feminine. You may have felt like you were with someone who was too masculine at times. Future. The King of Wands. Here's you showing up again. Or maybe another air, Fire Sign, Aries, Sagittarius, Leo. The Three of Cups. You know, celebration. Two of Cups, then the Three of Cups. Reconciliation. Happy times. For some of you, the person that you're with, their birthday is coming around. You'll be celebrating that with them, for them. You might even reconcile with them. But n none of this came without you cutting someone out. Capricorn, Virgo, Taurus, maybe. Sun, Moon, or Rising. Taurus is here. Right. Okay. Career and finance. Seven of hearts. The bottom of the deck is the two of club or the two of wands. Needing to chart a new path. Actively going in a new direction. There, It's not without opposition. It's not without hurdles. It's not without obstacles. But knowing that you, you have to go in a different direction. This is your energy, Aries, Sagittarius, Leo. Seven of Hearts. In the playing cards deck, this is the cheating spouse or partner. Someone who breaks promises. The Ten of Hearts. 
could have a family and then the ace of diamond some of you this water sign causes so much confusion for you because you already have something established here you already have a family life but you want a new foundational start maybe even marriage engagement moving in together solidifying a relationship in whatever manner but there's confusion there's emotional confusion here they keep trying to there's interference here the bottom of the deck for the additional supportive cards is join in join in means actively going to join a group of people who share your same interests networking joining an online dating site or a physical dating site join in talks about the physicality of joining a group not really online mm. talks about the connection that is between people actually interacting in person windfall windfall of good luck money home i mean just good luck money energy volunteer a lot of people are getting volunteer it's almost as this, the same as joining in i think this this is a six month so this type of energy joining in volunteering will bring you a, a sense of peace and serenity in a turbulent situation or in a situation where there is emotional confusion volunteering will also put you in a place where you feel like you've done something good and you are doing good dietary change just fell out of the off camera when I was shuffling pretty self explanatory talks about dietary change which is also a lifestyle change veganism vegetarianism pescatarianism just really watching what you consume your diet needs to change for some reason windfall volunteer uh, you have a very loving situation here but you're also already tied to something which could very well make this third party you know it very well could be a third party situation request a personal reading Sagittarius um, I feel like you need clarity it, it seems like you guys have been trying to get to this water sign be with this water sign forever some of you are already partnered some of you your water sign has been turning you down because of past hurt request a personal reading uh, pull, we can pull the energy for you to see how this turns out for you okay thank you all for tuning in once again um, if you can't request a personal reading uh, and you want to support the channel click that like button now subscribe to the channel comment below it's much appreciated and it's free um, take advantage of that uh, I'm, I think I'm gonna do like a little uh, raffle for those who comment whichever sign comments the most in their post in their June post I will um, do uh, two free five-minute readings. I know you say, what is five minutes? But in five minutes, you can learn a lot. So comment. But it's only if you comment. I see your comment. I will randomly select a commenter, and uh, they get a free reading. So comment, 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 all right? Remember, Sagittarius, when in doubt, pray. I'm praying for you. Pray for me as well. Take care. Also, you, your mm -hmm. card showed up. So, you know, when you show up in your own reading, it's almost to say that you're on the right path. You're, this is, it's happening 
for a reason. All right. Take care, guys.